All right, this this is a cool uh, thing from the Just Saying Institute. Just saying. And this is um, <laughs> this is about uh, uh, medical advancements, uh, and this is encouraging. Now, there's going to be a long way to go, but German researchers have enabled mice. Uh, that are paralyzed after spinal cord injuries to be able to walk again. I mean, oh my God. Reestablishing a neural link hitherto considered irreparable in mammals by using a designer protein injected into the brain. You know the ramifications of that? Yeah, it's going to destroy the mouse wheelchair industry. (laughs) (laughs) People may lose their job. Listen, people are going to be able to walk. It's going to be cataclysmic. Mice are going to be able to walk again. Let's keep our eye on the ball Come here. On. Spinal. Now, listen to this. Spinal cord injuries in humans often caused by sports or traffic accidents leave them paralyzed because not all the nerve fibers that carry information between muscles and the brain are able to grow back. Uh, but the researchers from, uh, excuse me, Ruhr University, Boca, managed to stimulate the paralyzed mice nerve cells to regenerate using a designer pro team. Dr. Turdballs is very encouraged. <laughs> right. <laughs> Uh, which is pretty wild. So when I when I started when I thought I had ALS, I was having these um, muscle spasms, are called fasciculations, and it really scared me. And so I went to a couple of neurologists, and one of them explained to me the the way nerve cells work. And, yeah. and I may be a little bit off base on this, but for the most part, the nerve cell, the nerve is a single cell. It's one thing. Yeah. And once you lose that. There's no way to regrow those. That's the thing. You can't regrow nerves, and oh. so that ha- therein why, why why those, you know, when you when you have nerve problems, that's why how final it is usually. Yeah. You know. Yeah. yeah. So I, 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 this is. I mean, this has been the holy grail. This has been the yes. thing. Now we have things that are uh, that are prophylactic, or, or I should say, um, a, a, a separate. Like exoskeletons, mobile exoskeletons that could that could allow people to to walk yeah, to have, with these, yeah. of, like a, like a, a war machine, yeah. in, you know. Yeah, to at least have a, some ability. ability yeah, um, but if you could regain, oh, and if you can regain oh. that ability to walk, then as you get older. Um, or people who have just natural deterioration, I assume you'd be able to refresh. That ability as well. So yeah. people have balance issues. Uh, the the main doctor, Doctor Turdball, was yeah. it? Uh, <laughs> said with a relatively small intervention, we stimulate a very large number of nerves to regenerate, and that is ultimately the reason why the mice can walk again. The paralyzed rodents that received the treatment started walking after two to three weeks. That's amazing. Uh, the treatment involves injecting carriers of genetic information into the brain to produce the protein called hyperinterleukin... Mouse to <laughs> They're going to have to change that when they get the humans, though, right? <laughs> Hyper interleukin, uh, inter globin globin, interleukin gluten galbin, uh, six. Yes, the team is investigating if the treatment can be improved. And he said, uh, that we also have to see if our methods work on larger mammals, right? We would think of like pigs, whales, pigs, dogs, or primates, for example. And then if it works, we would have to make sure that the therapy is safe for humans, too. But that will take many, many years. So, Probably not in our lifetime. But never say never. Yeah. That's what James Bond taught us. And um, I think that this is, um, it, with it, a lot of times people will, you know, everything starts a geometric progression. I mean, knowledge fires off additional knowledge. Everything goes out in, 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 in waves. So I think this can increase exponentially. I wouldn't be surprised if we're looking at something you know, these things come and people say, I never thought we'd get there. I'm always amazed, like when they said, you know, t- t- uh, travel at the speed of light. Yeah. Never be achieved, never be achieved. And it still seems like a, like impossible. However, they're starting to do things where they're sending particles at the speed of light. So, um, you know, it's a, we'll see. You never know. Yeah, yeah. We're also going to have a bunch of really, you know, athletic mice. Right. Uh, I thought I thought that was uh, that was pretty great news. That is there. good news. So, Every little, you know, baby steps or yeah. mouse steps. Mouse steps, if you will. 